One of the most favorite parts of the tefillah for me is when we place the Sefer Torah in the Aron Kodesh and we quote from Mishle, from Proverbs, Druachecha Darche Noam. The ways of Torah are sweet. This means as we go through life and all of us are faced different challenges along the way, we have to realize that there is never a Nisayon, an experience that is too difficult for us to bear. And I'll give you an example. The story goes back centuries, but its message is universal. The story goes that in the shul of the Vilna Gon in the 1700s, a man walked in and he opened the door of the shul and he yelled out, Rabosai, a fire swept through Main Street, devastating all the buildings that are there. One of the Misbalim, one of the congregants, heard the news and fainted on the spot. He was surrounded by people. They placed some water on his face. He woke up. He looked around. He realized why he fainted, and he fainted again. Once again, they were ready, ready to put water. The Vilna Gon says, wait, I'll do it. So the Gon placed a few droplets of water on the man's face. As soon as the man started to stir and gain, regain his consciousness, the Vilna Gon said, Reb Chaim, you should know your business was not destroyed. The Vilna Gon says that, you believe him. But right after Havdalah, Reb Chaim went to Main Street. And sure enough, all the businesses were destroyed except his was left standing. He went back to the Vilna Gon and he said, Rebbe, are you a prophet? And the Vilna Gon says, I'm not a prophet. I'm not the son of a prophet. But I saw your reaction. You were too devastated if it would have been your building and Hashem would not have given you such a test. The ways of God, as expressed in our Torah, are infinite, but he has so much compassion on us and we're never giving a situation a test that we can't overcome. Be it a global pandemic, an ice storm that causes your pipes to burst, a loss of electricity, forgetting where I place my keys, forgetting to take my cell phone, whatever it is, there's reasons why we're tested, but we always can do the right thing and overcome the challenges ahead of us. Rabosai, may we realize this and say to ourselves that whatever happens in life, Hashem directs us. Hashem directs it and it's all for our best.